But anyway, we've got a skit coming up for you guys. It involves uh, Brett Dickinson, who's one of my eighth grade boys. We got Akasita Bette, another eighth grade girl. And then we have the voices of Kyle Morris, Anna Bassetti, and Sam Napod. We simply call this skit, Sorry, No Change. Yes. <clears throat> I can't believe I'm so late. I hope I can catch my flight. Oh my goodness, I hate flying. Cramped up in that extremely uncomfortable seat. I'll probably get stuck by some big guy who won't let me sleep because he t can't stop talking. <laughs> Please, sir, do you have any spare change? I have a family I need to feed and I'm homeless, please. Dude, you need to get a job and stop harassing people. I said work for a living. So if I give you money, you're just gonna spend it on beer. I will not be part of your drinking habit. Get a job. So I gotta go. Oh, remember, your cousins are in town this weekend. They would love to see you. Do you think you could join us for church this Sabbath? Oh, I totally forgot they were coming. I'm just way too busy, Mom. I can't do it. Tell them I'm extremely sorry. I'm really sorry, but I gotta go. My plane's taking off. Bye, Mom. Love you. Man, I would like to see them, but I'm just way too busy. And besides, in church, Mom's been nagging me for years to come to church. Hello? Ricky, what's up, buddy? Billy, good to hear your voice again. What's up? Hey, I know you're on your way out of town. Just wanted to remind you about Vespers Friday night. I talked to you a few weeks ago about it, and you told me to remind you, so I'm reminding you. Look, I'm going to be so wasted by the time we get back, so I'm going to have to pass. Sorry. No problem. Just miss seeing you at church, so have a great trip. Thanks. Bye. Man, what's up with all this church stuff going on lately? I just want to take a nice nap and get this plane right over. Man, flying stinks. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, this is your captain speaking. We are experiencing some turbulence. Please remain calm and stay in your seats. Perfect. This is just what I need. <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, we are having mechanical difficulties and we are going to have to return to the airport. Flight attendants, prepare for emergency landing. Ah, oh, what am I going to do? God, please help me to get out of this mess. I'll do anything, I promise. I'll go to church with my mom every week. Whatever it takes. I'll go to Vesper's prayer meeting, whatever. Just get me out of here. I'll start praying tight again. Okay, combined budget two, whatever. Just get me home safe. Ladies and gentlemen, I am pleased to inform you that we have corrected the problem, but we are still going to land and make sure everything will be okay. We will let you off the plane and have you board another one. Sorry for the scare. Oh, God, thank you so much for getting me out of there. I'll remember everything I promise. Let me get my phone out and put church vespers and prayer meeting in my date book. Let's see, Saturday. Oh, I'm going up to the lake. Yeah, Saturday's not going to work. Uh, how about next week? Nope, too busy. Uh, maybe next month I'll be clear and I can make it. Uh, oh, yeah, tie the combined budget. Let me get out my checkbook right now. Oh, what a shame. One check left. Uh, I'll get you next month, God. I swear, I'm good for it. <laughs> Please, sir, do you have any spare change? I got you on this one, God. Sorry, no change. 